All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today we're talking about how to control the reactions that people leave on your posts or on other people's posts in Discord, especially if they use it to kind of like Pictionary out something offensive or sexual or if they try to like spell out something offensive with emojis that are just letters that have been left on somebody else's Discord and they have Nitro so they could just post them wherever. So whenever you see emojis that you don't necessarily want on a post, you can right click that post and you can click on reactions and you can see who left those reactions and how many people left them. And then if you wanted to, you could individually delete the ones that you don't like if there's only a couple of them. Otherwise, you'd have to right click and then you'd have to say, Clear all emojis from the mess from this message. Otherwise, if you don't want, don't want any emojis to be on this and you forgot to disable it, you'd have to right click it and click this big red button that says remove all reactions from the image, which deletes everything that appeared underneath of the picture. And now to disable that feature, if you go into edit channel under permissions on the everyone tag and any other role, that might have access to them, you want to disable the ability for people to add reactions to the posts. Now, if you trust people, and if you know people will abide by your rules, it's completely fine to allow higher level ranks and general purpose members of your server who have been around a while to use emojis and to leave reactions on things and then give them a chance to do something dumb and then ban them if they decide to break the rules but I am probably going to start enacting a policy of people are not allowed to post offensive combinations of uh, reactions in an emoji form under posts, and otherwise they will be banned. So that's just how you handle all of those things. And if you want to leave them, if you hover over a post, you just click on this add reaction button, and then you can just post whatever kind of reaction you want. And I got a few that I uploaded some of my admins have uploaded, you can post whatever you want, like a microphone. And then if you want to also vote that emoji, you can just click on that microphone to add another one. Obviously, I can't do that because I'm the one that posted it. But if there was another one, I could click it in order to react to that post with the same emoji. We'll just count up how many people have voted for that emoji. So that'll be it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. This has been how you handle add reactions to posts inside of Discord. Pretty much any post on any server, any communication, you can react with an emoji, kind of as a way to say like, I've seen it, I've, I've understood it, but I don't have time or didn't really want to, at this moment, write out a lengthy reply to whatever conversation topic is going on. Or you like it. It's like liking stuff on Facebook, I guess. So that'll be it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I've been your host, Larry, and I'll catch you next time. Bye everybody and have a good one.